All right, here's a little adjustment that you won't see many places. I haven't seen it any yet. I'm going over this, make sure all the feed mechanisms work, and I just realized that the upper feed disengagement wouldn't work. There's a, a lower feed. When this comes down and hits this, it pushes down on this entire rod and actuates this, which pushes the pin up and which allows this to drop out. like this. Now it's disengaged, so it would stop feeding. There's also one for going upwards. And that's this little pin sticking down here. Inside here is like a barbell looking thing. If that gets out of whack, it'll quit working. Mine is fine. However, if we push up on this, You can see the handle tried to move, but not quite. So if I was to have this thing feeding upwards, I would bust something. Down here is an adjustment for that. You just want to shorten the stroke up on this. You want to go ahead and shove that pin up a little bit more to give it more of a hair trigger. So you just simply turn your screw and then try again. The trick is, which way do you go, George? I always get mixed up when I look up stuff upside down, but I'm not 100% sure which way you go. Okay, the other way. Go okay, this way. Let's try there. So now it's working. Ideally, I'd like to have it disengaged before it bottoms out. And I think it is. I don't think I'm quite there. I don't think it's bottomed out before it disengages. Yeah. Let me, let me turn it some more. I dropped my Allen wrench over here. Need some light. Uh, let's see. Be nice if the Allen wrench would stay in there, huh? I'm going to turn it to extremes. I have an idea if I turn too much, it, it'll unlock altogether. I don't. There, that's like really tight. Let's see if it's got a hair trigger on it. Okay, that locks something up, so I went too far with it. So you're going to have to check this before you actually use it because that would have busted something also. You're going to have to reach in there and push on that little button. Make sure it is functioning correctly. Oh, my God. You see what I did? I didn't. I was trying to disengage it. And it was already disengaged. I feel stupid now. Ooh, do you see that? It's got a hair trigger now. You just barely move it. That's what we want. I'm not going to fool with it no more. I'm going to leave it right there. Watch how much that thing moves. See if I can get you the handle and this in the same frame.
So, you can... That's just the gravity, taking a handle down. Ready? And push. So that ought to do it. Now we can check, of course, check her down too. Yeah, now you hardly got to push on that thing for it to disconnect. So that actually adjusts both of them, makes both of them more of a hair trigger. So there you go. That's how you adjust that. Good luck.